rocks over there. She's gonna whoop my ass, see? <laughs>
How can I incorporate that in my business? Like, should I start doing scratch up cards? Like, that sounds pretty cool. But I was thinking more like, I have a scratch up cards for my business, and you know, and behind the cards would be like something free, like maybe a free tablecloth, free this, free that. But it'll be a different card every time you buy. So everyone will win, everyone will get a free product. I'm like, damn, that sounds pretty cool. So I'm already looking into that. It's so simple to make that. And then I can go as far as teaching a class. But y'all, let me show you. TikTok, what take off the most on my TikTok is when I make, when I peel my vinyl because I get my oracle like my oracle this the little sticker vinyl that y'all use for like shot glasses and wine glasses for some reason when I peel them it peels perfectly so people like watching that and they like to hear like the peeling sound they say that it's what's the word they said that it's um not relaxing I can't think of it satisfying or something like that so I want to show you the print so my prints like this one for when I do like tablecloths and of course stylus tape. Cause why would you have a little, why would you have a little logo on your stylus tape? That's be big and seen so when you're recording your work people can see it on. This order has no correlation to the story, but I wanna say thank you for being patient. This order is the tablecloth, paste scanners, silk bags, and face masks. So the silk bags I have are cream, the face mask, I believe she had two adults, a toddler, and a and two kid face masks. I used this special holograph type of vinyl for the words. This is not how a logo actually looks. I made glamorous more glamorous as I should. That's what I like to do in my business. People like their stuff to pop. I made it pop. And here's the paste scanner. She wanted the holograph words for it too. Here's the vinyl. Here's just me peeling the vinyl for her tablecloth. This is where I got it from on Amazon. It was about $13. At the bottom, I like to include people contact information or, you know, that social media. I think it's a great idea. We had a pop-up shop. Instead of telling people like, hey, this is that, you know, they can look at your tablecloth and just get it off of there. So. I got the large print. I printed it on my 11 by 17 printer. They don't really have a large sizes or a lot of sizes, but and they don't have about four colors, but I make it do what it do. These are transfer sheets that I use, 11 by 17 dark transfer paper, but you can always get white for white sheets. I actually ran out because I used it for someone else's order, so I just use my dark transfer paper for the face mask. You know, you can you can still use it for this. It does the same thing, but on Amazon, I got three different size masks. It's like the large adult mask, the kid mask, and the toddler mask. This is the paper that I use to protect the iron-on when I iron it on there. And then this is just a little Cricut iron that I like to use so that I can make sure everything is in place. And the colors do print out very vibrant. See, these are three different sizes. Adult, kid, and toddler. And then here are the silk bags. See, they are not white, they're cream, which is actually cute. I'm trying to, I think I was trying to record so that I can get a nice photo, a nice video for the TikTok or the Instagram reel, but... It just wasn't working. Like this all scruffed up. Everything was just wasn't working right. I like the photo to look like it's more product, like it's full. I really love the way that looks like. You know, even if it's six, I'll make it look like 30. Just me organizing it. Organizing the order now because I was about to get ready to pack everything up and ship it out. You know, when you do these type of videos, you have to literally move your camera like 15 million times. I am so glad that I got this stand. This dang stand, this goddamn stand that's steady biting my fingers off. 
anyways so i like to use this paper i get this from dollar tree paper from dollar tree because it's only a dollar but i just found out the other day that family dollar has that paper too also for a dollar you don't get that many sheets but come on it's like a dollar and i can use that on two orders so it's a decent amount of money the tape i always buy my tape from dollar general i really love dollar general that's my store so I don't just, you know, you're supposed to keep like the tape dispenser. You're supposed to like buy new rolls. So that's what I do. I just keep my tape dispenser there and then I buy my new rolls. I think I put about three, I mean, sorry, not three, about six sheets in the box, like for the bottom. I, I love to use my, my glitter sheets and then some color sheets. Okay, well, that's my six. Damn, I'm wasting a lot of damn product. All right, so this is a tablecloth. This is a face mask. I don't, you know, I saw people on TikTok wrapping their stuff, so I thought that maybe I should do that too. So I start wrapping my stuff like this too. Shit, y'all not finna leave me out. I think they tape it, but I don't got time for all that, you know. Add some more unnecessary paper. And I just start really using this what they call this popcorn shipping popcorn i don't know thank you all so much for watching please like comment subscribe i'm done putting too much thought into what am i going to post on youtube i'm going to treat this like my tiktok and just do my work record it and then post it so this should be like the extended version of my tiktok videos